In Nanaimo, uh, there's been an overnight visitor who left a smelly mess for a North End homeowner. The woman says the bear wandered into her yard in the middle of the night, was pawing at her back door, then uh, relieved itself and tore down part of her fence. Conservation officers say the mess it left behind is evidence of what's going on at this time of year when bears are looking to bulk up heading into hibernation. CTV's Chandler Grieve has a few tips tonight on how to keep these bulking up bears away. He came from over there from the road and then he was scratching at my door because it was all dirty and you could see the paws and everything. It was an early morning intruder that certainly left their mark. The funny thing is I fell back asleep again and then when I woke up and opened my blinds, I saw this big huge hole there. So, oh my God, what the heck happened here? And then I saw the big pile of poops. So, oh, there had been a bear. In, you know, through here. Sunday night, Maria Timms awoke to what she thinks is a black bear rummaging through her garden. This was very scary. It got me shaken up all day long, but uh, it's okay now. After the bear did its business, it appears it chose to make a loud and grand exit. Big crash over there. That's the most awful noise I ever heard. But I couldn't see anything because it was dark, right? It was very dark. Maria's North Nanaimo neighborhood backs into a large wooded area and conservation officers say while the bear did not show any signs of aggression towards humans, caution during the months leading up to winter and hibernation is needed. Uh, bears particularly uh, this time of year are interested in putting on some fat to go into hibernation. They're really looking for calories. Uh, they're comes to people, they do come into some of the residential areas that are nearby uh, the forestry areas. Although Maria will need to rebuild a portion of her fence, the bear was kind enough to leave behind the avid gardener some special fertilizer. Nice big black poo. Then I thought, oh, might as well throw it on my rhubarb. Good fertilizer. <laughs> Conservation officers say the number one attraction for bears is garbage, followed by fruit trees and bird seed. And if you encounter a bear, make yourself look big and back away slowly. Chandler Grieve, CTV News, Nanaimo.